Okay, so I am going to make a wedding board. It's not really a board. I got this weekly planner thing from work. Um, I like want it um, and I haven't used it yet. So we're gonna use it because it has fully adhesive post-it notes. If you can hear like crackling, Molly's playing with her bone on her chair. Um, so I'm gonna open this and we're gonna make like a wedding board. Now, this is gonna be my first video in my like wedding planning series. It's not really gonna be like a full traditional wedding planning uh, like series or wedding planning videos that you've seen before because we're not having a traditional wedding. Um, we are actually just going to go down to the courthouse and get married. Um, I don't even know if that's the correct term. I don't know if it's like like a civil ceremony, I guess, um, is what we're doing. And so, yeah, we don't have like an actual like wedding, wedding to plan. It's gonna be the two of us, obviously, and like my family, his family, and that's it. So I'm gonna take this top one off. Because I'm not doing a regular, like traditional wedding, there's not a ton that I have to plan for, but we're about two and a half months away from the wedding. We're getting married um, April 28th. We were originally gonna get married April 22nd, but we moved it back um, a week. So we're gonna get married April 28th. And so it's a super short engagement. Literally anytime I tell somebody that we're getting married in April, they're like, this April? I'm like, yeah, this April. So there's not a ton to plan for, but there is like some stuff to do. So this might not be like the best wedding board ever, but we're gonna try and like make it work. So I actually don't think that I'm gonna do like some wedding boards that I've seen where you have different categories of things um, because like I said this is not a traditional wedding and that's just kind of stressing me out trying to find categories for everything to fit in so instead I'm just gonna make like a massive to-do list um, the only things that I think that I'll do is like pink stuff will be what we need to do together yellow stuff or things that I write on yellow post-its will be like my things I need to do for me and then blue things will be things that like are Dave centered I'm not gonna say that he needs to do for himself because like I have to buy his ring and I have to well he already picked out his ring I'm pretty sure we settled on one there was like two that we were he was deciding between so I need to make sure that he has finalized one and then like I'm ordering it since he paid for my rings I'm paying for his rings or uh, his ring so his ring and then like I'm gonna help him figure out what he wants to wear um, if he wants me to so of course Molly's drinking water right now so we're gonna do the stuff that we need to do together first marriage license and I'm trying to decide if I want two copies of that because I've seen that you can get like an extra copy for like $5 or something like that. I'm trying to decide if I want an extra copy of that because um, I'm thinking that I'm going to make like a marriage book, like a photo book. I want to put together like a photo book of like everything having to do with the wedding. So like I want to, I have some extra engagement pictures that are printed so i want to put those in there um i want to print like the photos of all the dresses that i did try on when i went dress shopping um because i do have a dress i did go dress shopping and like there's while this is not going to be a traditional wedding there are going to be some things i feel like i'm like oddly cut off um there's not going to be like it's not a traditional wedding, but we I did want some like traditional things. And the two big things were like, I wanted a dress, I wanted a cake, <laughs> a dress. So I wanted to get like all of the other pictures of all the other dresses because I was between two dresses and I almost bought a different dress. So I just, I, like I want those memories. So I want to print those out 
um, and add them to the photo book. The, like all the stuff, like my hair trials and like a shopping for stuff and like our cake tasting and like going to get our, the day we get our marriage license. Like I wanna take pictures of all of those moments and put it into a photo album. And then like obviously the day of pictures of like us getting ready and the actual wedding and like us actually married. I want all of that in one photo album. So I don't know where I was going. Oh yeah, so the extra certificate, I was like, maybe we could get it and then put it in the photo album as well, like a keepsake to have. So, cause like, I don't want to frame it. That's weird. <laughs> um, that's not weird. If you do that, that's okay. It's not something that I want. <laughs> so we need a date appointment. I'm pretty sure so we're gonna put a question mark there but I'm pretty sure we're gonna need to at least figure that out we need to figure out what we're doing with Molly right now our options are either to board her where we get her um, groomed at or we're gonna see if she could be crated while we're gone here at home but then we would need somebody to stay with her because we're not staying here the night of the wedding so we would need to figure that out so yeah she's on here that's something that we need to do together we decide on food for that day like dinner and breakfast for us so what we're planning on doing is after the wedding like after we get married and we take pictures and stuff like that with family um we're planning on like the two of us since we're already gonna be downtown we're planning on the two of us getting a hotel that day and like just the two of us going out to dinner and then like the next morning going out for like brunch or something like that so and then we also need to figure out the hotel that we want to stay at I know what hotel there's two hotels that I want to stay at um, downtown one of them is the JW and then the other one I don't remember what it's called I think it's bottle works is the other one that I want to stay at because we walked through it this summer with my family and like literally like we just walked through it because we were going to bottle works and it was beautiful and my sister-in-law and my brother were saying that they I think they stayed there and they really liked it so I also want to stay there but we'll kind of just see those are all the things that we have to do out oh, in a registry I started working on one and I did not finish it so it's mainly like to be fully honest I'm probably going to be doing the majority of the registry but he can also add things or like give input on like I think we should have this I think those are all the things that we need to do together now we're gonna do his stuff order ring figure out what he's wearing and he's been talking about how he wants to like change up his hair a little bit his hair is really long um and so he's been talking about cutting it just like a little bit shorter so I was like you probably want to do that like early enough so that like it's the way that you want it on the day that we get married so we're gonna say hair oh we also need to do together the cake whether or not we're gonna go to like Costco and buy a Costco cake or go to like a fancy cake place I don't know so we need to figure that out I need to make an itinerary for the day because I'm thinking that like I'll be with the night before the wedding I'm staying at my parents house and I'm hoping that like my brother and his wife and my sister and her husband and her kids are gonna be there with them, have dinner with them, spend the night there, and then they can, like the girls will help me get ready and we'll all just kinda like chill at the house together that day and like do just like some us pictures and um, I'm hoping, I'm, I don't wanna say because I'm pretty sure my parents do watch my videos, so I don't wanna say a little surprise that I'm thinking of, but, um, I have something planned for me and mainly my dad like have brunch or breakfast or something like that and like champagne and stuff like that this is what I've thought of um, I obviously have to make sure that my parents are okay with it because it's their house but um, that's what I'm thinking for us and then like figuring out how we're getting downtown and all that kind of stuff and then for him and his side of the family 
I think his friend is gonna come in the night before, so they'll have like, you know, guy time or something together. His parents are gonna come up that morning, have, you know, breakfast with him or something like that, and then we'll all show up. Cause I'm thinking we're not gonna get married until the afternoon is what I would prefer. I would prefer to wait till like the afternoon so that I can have the morning the way that I'm envisioning it. Envisioning it. So we'll just kind of see. But, so I need to make a day of itinerary. Um, I have a dress fitting in two weeks. It's two weeks from yesterday, because today is Sunday. <laughs> Sorry about that. Uh, but now it is quite dark in here, so. To return the veil and belt that I purchased with it for two reasons. One, they were stupid expensive. <laughs> it's basically half my dress. Like the veil and the belt that I bought were legitimately half the price of my dress. That is ridiculous. So I don't think I'm gonna do a veil anymore. If I want, if I end up wanting a veil, then I'll just buy it on Amazon because I'm planning on buying my belt off of Amazon because I do really want a belt, but I'm just planning on buying a belt um, on Amazon. So I need to take those back soon so that I can get store credit for them. I can't return them to get my money back, but I can return them to get store credit so that I can use that towards um, paying for the dress fitting. So to make our invitations, because it's just gonna be family, I don't really <laughs> wanna put like that much into invitations. I'd made invita invitations before and I did not like the way, A, they did not turn out well, but B, they now have the wrong date printed on them. And I just, I don't really feel like I need to do that. I'm gonna try and like make my own and then we need to mail them. I know that everybody that we're sending an invitation to is coming. So like, it's more of like a, just so they can have the invitation. Flowers, I don't know what I wanna do about like flowers for me, like a bouquet or something like that. I don't know. We'll put it on here, just in case, with a question mark. Just in case I want that. I know that I want to, I need to go find a photo album. Um, I have no idea where I would get one of those, maybe like Michael's or something like that. But I want to Cricut on the front, um, like our last name and the date of when we're getting married so that that's on there. So I need to like actually make that and then start putting stuff together for it. I need to do hair trials. I originally said that I was just going to like twist my hair like I normally do the night before or the day before. And then the day that we're getting married, I was just gonna like undo it so that my hair is curly. But now I'm also kind of considering straightening my hair. So I don't know. So don't know how I want my hair to be. We're probably gonna have to do two hair trials. Okay, I put both hair trials on there to do a makeup trial because I'm gonna be doing my own makeup. I mean, they're gonna help me get ready, but like I'm probably gonna do my own makeup. So I need to figure out how I'm doing my makeup. I am wanting to be tan at this point, so I will probably need to do like, I think I wanna do self tanner though. Um, just because I don't know that I really feel comfortable with doing a spray tan because I don't know I've heard good and bad things about spray tans and I've self tanned myself before um, and I'm a little bit more comfortable with that so I need to figure out what I'm gonna do with my nails okay so I think that this is what the board looks like and so yeah the pink stuff the stuff that we have to do together the blue stuff is Dave's stuff and then the yellow stuff is my stuff so I'm gonna we, need, we definitely need to start getting on this and get working on it so that we can start just taking stuff off the list um, because we have two and a half months and I've kind of been telling myself like oh like since we're not really doing a traditional wedding like I a lot of this stuff I don't have to worry about but it's kind of coming up quick. We have two and a half months and I feel like we really need to get a move on these things and kind of get stuff settled. I would say like high priority stuff, I'm actually gonna star because like they need to be done ASAP. Eight appointment is super important. Booking a hotel needs to be done soon. 
finishing the registry needs to be done soon because some people that like aren't coming to the wedding have been asking um like for our registry link so i need to get that done so that more people can add to it if they want um we need to figure out the cake soon because like if we have to order that ahead of time i don't know how far in advance we need to order that ahead of time um we need to make and mail the invitations that needs to be done soon again like i know everybody's coming but still like i think it's just kind of courteous to give them an invitation i need to return the veil and the belt very soon and we need to order day swing soon so those are all of the things that we need to do like quickly um probably like within the next two to three weeks we kind of need to get those things done so so yeah that was making my ready my wedding board with me um i don't know how many videos i'm gonna have just because like i said i feel like this is like not traditional so i don't know like how much is gonna fit in every single vlog but i will vlog anything that's due to the wedding will be like its own separate video um and i'll make like a wedding playlist and everything like that on my channel so yeah i am excited like i will say i'm it's i feel like it's very easy if you're not having like a traditional wedding and you're just going to the courthouse for it to feel like not a big deal but this is a big deal like this is a really big deal and i want it to feel special and like something very true to the two of us but still like important and special and fun so that's why I like I, I want to still give it the same energy that I would if I was making like if I was planning a real wedding or like no, not a real wedding I don't want to say real wedding but like a traditional wedding um I want to give it the same energy because this is our wedding like this is the day that we become husband and wife that is so weird to say out loud like he's gonna be my husband that is so weird but also very exciting yeah that was it for this one guys thank you so much for watching don't forget to like this video and subscribe for more especially if you want more wedding content because that is coming and i'll see you in my next one okay bye